Eh, bebé. Eh, bebé. Is it not? That brick can't fall now on us. Do you want me to do anything with Bertha or? No. Nope. Okay. <laughs> Work perfect, baby. Very good. Do we need to lift up on it, maybe? Yep. Okay. Losing that water piece. Okay. Figure out. Okay. Well, we lost the close. we lost the corner piece. But that's alright. It didn't break. Okay. That one fell, but didn't break and knocked the ladder. Okay. The forks of the of Bertha caught the big stone. Which is why it was there. Yeah. This cornerstone over here came loose, but, all right. So I just need to figure out how to catch that stone. Right. We got the lintel on the forklift. Yeah. Now this wall is just sitting there and I'm holding a, one of the pillars up. So there's the, the lentils on the forklift. She's not going anywhere. Now I gotta take this wall and I'm holding this pillar up because it's about ready to fall. I don't want it to fall like that one did. Nope, but at least it didn't break. We didn't break it. But Carrie's gonna unscrew that from the floor. And then we're gonna slowly move this wall back. This million dollar wall, look at all that lumber. Woohoo! Strong pillar of bricks right there. <laughs> this is holding up. How this house did not fall before. I mean, this literally. 
these two stacks because they're not really together. These two stacks I'm holding up not the house. I guess yes on that, that wall, yes. But these two stacks were holding up this whole thing. Mm. And they just come apart. Oh. Brick walls should not do that. Well, yeah. I have no. Well, and the ones that are, the joints that are really kept dry are still strong are and. still strong. You have to break them apart. So. They're few and far between. So, I'm just curious. I'm going to take. This is the gap right here. And I'm gonna move this sill stone and this corner stone and see if I can close the gap to find out if it's even possible before I go tearing down the rest of the wall. Who knows? I think I'm going to have to do both walls. I was hoping I didn't have to do the front wall. I'm going to try to move this stone over. Try being the keyword. See what it looks like once I get it to where it's supposed to be. So. Like that. This one move like this. These are heavy. Yes, they are. But leverage helps. You're moving all of those. All of what? Those two on that side. Up and down. All of those? No, I'm just seeing, yeah. I'm just seeing those two go up and down. I think they're still stuck to the rock. They're just going up and down. Yeah, and uh, we're back at it. We are continuing taking the facade down. Saga. Yeah, and uh, we're continuing on, keeping on, keeping on, right? Yeah. That's what you want to call it. Uh, yeah. It is super humid today, but a quick glimpse of the castle in shadow. I think that's just cool, like I said before. And sawing out the mortar is a gentle way of loosening the joints because that needs to come down so it doesn't fall down. I guess these are the post posts on the windows all marked. Like I've a, been calling them the frame styles or something. I yeah, don't know. we don't know. Got the brick stack, that's just mortar and little pieces of limestone. And we're continuing on. I don't know if anybody has heard me say this, or I don't know that I've said it, but uh, we're not sure where to stop. So. I know there's still cracks going the rest of the way down. 
but I mean this has been holding itself up for many many years I've already determined that we'll probably pour concrete as a tie-in yeah I'm trying to remember what the top border and then go up with a pillar of concrete with or a concrete block with rebar and concrete filled cavities since those two stacks of brick just didn't have any support and um, they lasted a long time and they would yeah but. but and unless you saw it you would never know yeah I'm not this is all behind the wall so right so I certainly it would not be to code to make it like that no to just stack bricks would not be to code so since we're going back with it we'll figure out how to do it why to do it how much to do but these are some big rocks to play with yes they are all right and this isn't dangerous there no we. there's the scaffolding right there Ta -da! and i even swept it off so it wouldn't be slick so okay here comes carrie to pick up another stone for me we're going to try to see if we can get this stone onto those forks. Rock's really heavy. But it's gotta be done. Where do hernias usually happen? <laughs> can they get you can you get a hernia while you're sitting down or do you have to be standing up? I think it's lifting anyway. If it's you or the rock, let the rock go. Yeah. I'm giving you that advice. Yep, there we go. What can go wrong now? All of it. You know, these stones don't look that big from the ground. They're bigger. Yeah. All right. Good job. I didn't think that one was coming up pretty easy. We need a scale. <laughs> it probably weighs about as much as I do. What, 95? <laughs> what was that piece of advice you just said? Always underestimate. 34 years of marriage. 
18 wonderful years. <laughs> Again, my cat is hanging. What are you doing? What are you doing, Mia? Mm -hmm. Knocking my pine cones off so you can hang out? Mm hmm? Is that what you're doing? What are you doing? Just hanging out too? Oh, you girls are silly. You girls are silly. Yes, you are. Mm hmm. My, my sweet girl. Sis. Mia. You're a silly girl. Yeah. You're gonna get down now? Okay. Good girl.